Well, hello, Club Sky High. This is Mary Ann, and I am uh, making this short little video to show you how to add new products to your website. So, what's happening here is we have set up blocks. This is a full, complete block right here showing a particular product. This is another full, complete block right here showing a, a particular product. And to add more products, you are going to want to have a use of a mouse with your um, with your regular computer. Not don't try to do this on a phone or something like that. But um, have a mouse; it'll make your life a lot easier on this. So basically, I've set up these blocks, and these blocks are all from the AB container or Atomic Blocks container. And uh, here's one that's a paragraph. This one's a heading. Uh, this is a paragraph and we have these set up like so. So what we're going to do is we're going to actually copy all the stuff in the first container. Okay? Hit Command C. You have now copied that. Go underneath. Okay? Start a whole new block. Make sure you're not in the same block that you were working on previously. Go to the one that says Add AB Container. If you don't see it up there, click the plus sign. It may be in the most used blocks because we've used it on your website. Or you could go down, scroll down to Atomic Blocks, and voila, there's AB Container there too. But I think in this case what we're going to do is just take it right out of what's going to be probably straight up on the easiest to reach. So click that. Now you do Command B. You paste. So you have now pasted the new content in. And I am just taking this off of Leafly um, just to kind of give you an example of what you have on Leafly right now. You won't be using that later, but um, the next product up on the Leafly website is Deep Purple. There is no room for a description on Leafly, but I know that Rachel wants you to be able to add one. Uh, and then this is the cost. And that hasn't changed any from the other. I should sit, let you know that I'm using a little upright line to kind of separate these, which I think um, makes it easier for people, your clients, to read it. So that one's done that quick. I'm going to hit update. And once it is updated, I'm going to go up and view the page. And here it is. That's the latest one we just added. So you can see how nicely it's going to be easy for people to go through and look at these, find what they want. Um, one more thing. Let's say you don't have a product anymore and you need to, to get rid of it. Let's, let's remove it. So scroll down here. Let's say this product right here. Make sure you're scrolling so that you hit everything. That entire block comes up. Click that button there, the little grid thing. Then click these here for the more options. Select Remove Block. It's gone. Voila. Let's say you want to move another product, and then of course you'll update your page. Let's say you want to move a product up above the other one. Again, make sure you have the whole block highlighted and move it up. Therefore, this one's on top now, and this one's on the bottom. We can move it down in the same fashion. And again, you'll update your page when you're done. So it's that easy to uh, move things around. Just make sure you grab the entire block, not just part of it, not just the header or the description, but the entire block. To add a description, you just click in right there and start. This is a description. etc. So it's that easy. Uh, enjoy. You have a great day.